Welcome to Stone Hands, to the hands of stone, the way of the self, the way of inner vision, the way to empower thyself by knowing who you are, where you are coming from, and what you are about. How long does your lineage go? There was a study that 72% of people in Great Britain were related to the royal family since AD 1500 or so. So our history goes long way back, but longer we go back in time, the more related we are to each other. And understanding it, we can understand our place in this world and to make better relationships with other people. Can you tell me the name of your forefathers and foremothers? How many generations you are able to go back and know their names and know their deeds? Like the royal households. Let's take for example the nobility in UK. The people can go back 10 people, 15 people. They go and go back in the lineage for 1000 years and understand where they are coming from. Such rootedness and groundedness gives an extraordinary ability to a person to understand their own belonging and their own duty in this world. Of course, all of us cannot go back such a long way, but we are able to awaken the innermost molecules of DNA and to see in our vision our forefathers and foremothers and understand their place in this world. What were they able to do? What did they accomplish? Where did their great ways bring them in their lives? What were they all about? Yes, awakening your inner potential and your inner eye helps to understand the place of belonging. And it's always possible to be in communion through, uh, through meditation and go back to the root race of humankind. Coming towards the first people who lived on this plane the first people who descended over here. Yes, I don't believe that we come from an ape. No, the link is missing. We are not ape people. We are a people. We are the people. We come from other, other planets. And we are the descendants of a cosmic race. So we have all the rights to rule our galaxy. Okay, not to dominate, I don't mean by that. But to travel, to explore, to experience the whole galaxy and all the galactical beings that are there in this world. But to understand our position as galactic beings, we must understand our own ancestry and to release the trauma coming throughout generations, the trauma of war, the trauma of need, 
the drama of not remembering who we are. So we must become again the true galactic race. Yes, we descend from 12 different constellations and we ourselves are the 13th constellation as the human race has nailed their memory to the collective memory of the planet of our galaxy into the Milky Way indeed but few simple tricks to understand who we are and where we do belong we can begin by studying our own lineage who were our fathers and mothers and grandfathers and grandmothers ask from our relatives the stories the deeds of our relatives where they lived where they were born what kind of li lives they lived were they happy or sad and so on and next thing we can start studying the history of our larger tribe of our, of our own people of our own tribe of our own nation and to study different perspectives on history because a guide a lot of history has been modified by those who have been conquering, of course. And from there, if we, if we have laid the first foundation, we can go to explore physically those places where our ancestry comes from, to meet our real race, to meet our real ancestors and to Acquaint uh, ourselves with their deeds, with their way of living, their way of being. And after that, he can go into the, into the practices of meditation or, yes, in meditation and look back in time. We can do it in dreams, we can do, do it through sounds, we can do it through, through substances. It just depends on a person, what is your own belief and the way of connection. And after that, we get a more clear view of where we are and who we are and what we are all about on this planet and going through those rites of ancestry we can become more aware of our own deeds at this present time and to be accountable of the things that we have done on this planet and we will be able to create a more sustainable future, a more sustainable livelihood to all the living beings on this planet as the great mass extinction is going on and great formation of a new kind of life on this planet. So it's time to remember where we are coming from and where we are going to. So I wish you a good day. Goodbye.